Hi all, I'm going to show you quickly how to upload something to YouTube and then add that to Google Classroom. Um, so here's youtube.com. If you are signed into your Gmail account, you should see your little um, profile picture or first letter your name right over here in a circle. If not, sign in. Um, this little plus um, camera is, is how you start to upload a video. So this is how you create. Once you have a video that you've made in a screencast or something, um, click that and select a file. So um, I'm going to find one that I just made. Maybe I can find one of my Zoom ones. So here's one of my Zoom meetings. The MP4. Um, I'll need to give it a new title. So that was like how to use Zoom to screencast. And I'll have that too, because I already have one like that. Um, go down, you can't click the thumbnail yet. Choose the playlist that you want to put it in. This just kind of helps you get organized. Um, I'll choose distance learning tools because it's about Zoom. Um, you're going to be asked eventually if it's made for kids or not. Um, my whole channel is just defaulted to yes, it's made for kids. Um, right away, it's going to give you um, your video link. So that's something that you'll want to use later when you're adding it to Google Classroom or just linking it into an assignment or a Google Doc. Um, click next here. And you can just click next here again. Um, what I want to share is really important about public, unlisted, and private. If you have any sort of student information like their faces or their names, make sure that it is um, unlisted or private. Uh, if you want it to be really searchable, like maybe it's a, it's, um, a video that is for students and has no um, student information in it, you can make it public. Um, a lot of mine are going to be public because I want people to be able to find them by looking at my channel. If they, um, if they're not, if they're unlisted or private, then then you can't find the video by looking at the channel. You can only find it if you have the link. Um, so it'll take a little while to publish, um, but right away it gives me this link, and that's what I want to go put on Google Classroom. So I'll copy the link and. Go to classrooms, classroom, find my pretend class. So always be thinking like all of these things. Here I have all these other people's names. So I need to be careful about um, sharing anything in your video. You got to be thinking about privacy. Here's my specialist practice class. Um, so I can share something and add a link, and there we, I go. I just paste it in there, um, or I can make it part of classwork. And there it is. Um, another little, uh, a little trick when you are writing, um, writing something in a Google Doc to um, to make words um, the link. You can obviously like insert hyperlink, but the shortcut is Control K and then Control V. Super easy. And there's my video.